one is terrain that is tract of land territory or terrains next is your tundra that is your special words or you can say particular word treeless land in arctic region we cannot say anywhere it is tundra tundra is a specific name arctic region upland downland lowland plain plateau plateau is between soil and mountain mountain will be highest point or you can say maximum projection on this uh, projection on this earth surface soil is the lowest projection other than water if you are going to the under the sea then you will find the further lower level but other than water what is whatever visible is there that is soil is lowest in between soil and mountain that is plateau many of the area will be plateau region in india if you will see then many of the plateaus are there and all plateau region will be very mineral rich very mineral rich valley another is low land between hills like krishna krishna giri hills between what will have two uh, two very high hills will be there then between these two hills very low land will be there that land is called valley after then uh, land without forest then study of land geography and topography both are related to study of land scenery natural features of country land seen or scenic waste land barren desert heath or moor small fertile land in waste land oasis sometimes we used to say but these four lands are there wherever waste land is there means it is unfertile it cannot do anything sometimes we are telling it is a desert registan only sand will be there like arab, arab country you will go many of the country or if uh, in india you are going to rajasthan many of the area will be there you will find desert nothing you can't expect anything even water also will not there then barren desert and afterwards uh, heath moor these four major categories there related to wasteland now many of the land which government or will be controlled or politically controlled that will called in different different way one is dominion one is dominion like just suppose british people are british people are uh, ruling to india but not all part of india not all part of india any certain part of india then that part of india they can say it is a british dominion it is actually in india they can't say it is a british nation but it, it can say it is a temporary controlled by the british that is british dominion means dominated by british enclave outclave both are having almost similar meaning but difference will be there like one nation or one particular race is having certain certain influence or certain uh, you can say land they they are having the control and all around just suppose this land is there related to one particular uh, country or particular uh, uh, political party or polit uh, you can say nation just surrounding this same nation is there then it is called enclave it is called enclave but we just suppose it you have certain land but surrounding all these are there they are having different country then we can say it is exclave territory land ownership i think uh, this you will find very uh, all very familiar words whatever we are using day to day campus any institutions or any of the things are there whatever uh, fortified area will be there that is called campus estate free old manor park plot terrace real estate yard farm house land owner and tenants landlord lease and territorial lease these are you can say related to land different type